uh, today I will cover one concrete table inheritance pattern. This concrete table inheritance pattern belongs to object relational structural patterns. And uh, this object relational structural patterns belongs to patterns of enterprise application architecture. First, we will uh, see the explanation of uh, concrete table inheritance pattern. Uh, this is the explanation. Uh, represents an inheritance hierarchy of classes with one table per concrete class in the hierarchy. So we will see one example so that uh, you will understand the uh, this sentence. Um, so here you can see in the left side uh, we have a player. Uh, so the player is a super class and it has a name attribute and uh, footballer and cricketer are uh, subclasses uh, which uh, inherits a uh, player class so it has club and uh, this cricketer has batting average and uh, this bowler uh, it has bowling average attribute at and it inherits uh, cricketer uh, super class okay and this is the inheritance hierarchy okay so if you see this one footballer is a subclass of uh, player so it will have name plus this club uh, attributes and the cricketer is a subclass of uh, player so it this cricketer will have name and batting average attributes and the bowler is the subclass of uh, cricketer uh, so it will have name batting average and the bowling average so how we can represent this inheritance hierarchy of uh, classes in a database table or how we can store this footballer cricketer and bowler information in uh, some database table so how we can uh, define a uh, tables for uh, this inheritance hierarchy so how we can do is as per the concrete table inheritance pattern uh, for each concrete classes we will define one table okay so in this case this player is the abstract class and this footballer cricketer and bowler are the concrete classes concrete classes meaning the classes uh, which will have all implementation there is no abstract method uh, will be there okay so as per this one represent inheritance hierarchy of classes with one table per concrete classes so we will define uh, three tables so we have uh, three concrete classes one is footballer cricketer and bowler so we will define for footballer one table footballers table and it has name and club and because footballer inherits player so name and club attribute will be there so here we are defining name and club and the cricketer has uh, name plus batting average so we will define cricketers table which uh, has name and batting average uh, column and uh, bowler uh, bowler inherits cricketer and the cricket inherits uh, player so bowler will have uh, three attributes name batting average and bowling average so we will define bowlers table uh, which has uh, three columns name batting average and bowling average so in this way uh, we can uh, define tables for this inheritance hierarchy okay uh, so this is the second point relational database don't support inheritance so you uh, usually the relational database won't support inheritance so when uh, mapping from objects to database we have to consider how to represent our nice inheritance structure in relational tables so here what we are doing is using uh, a concrete table inheritance pattern we are defining uh, each table for one concrete class so this is the way and uh, third point is it is similar to class table inheritance so what is class table inheritance uh, what is the definition of class table inheritance what is the example of class table inheritance that i have uh, uh, done separate video please log into my uh, channel and watch that uh, class table inheritance design pattern so that you will understand the difference between class table inheritance and uh, this concrete table uh, inheritance design pattern okay uh, so it is similar to class table inheritance but one difference is that only concrete classes are mapped to table uh, and all fields of concrete classes are mapped to the table even if classes duplicates in between tables okay uh, as per class table uh, inheritance for each classes uh, we have to define table so 
uh, if you watch my class table in a returns pattern there will be four four table will be there uh, for player also one table will be there but in concrete classes in returns only we have to define uh, tables for the concrete classes okay uh, so this is the difference between con uh, class table inheritance pattern and uh, concrete table inheritance pattern if you want to uh, know more about class table inheritance pattern please log into my channel and watch uh, class table inheritance pattern and uh, this is about uh, concrete table inheritance pattern thanks for watching